parents don't have the mindset because we got things, you know, 16 and pregnant. So, you know, young girls thinking they're going to get rich. Hey, I could be on TV. You know what I mean? Right. We got a caller. Okay, I'm going to pick up this caller. Hello. Hi, welcome. Hi, I heard uh, you guys were sort of talking about the perils of reality TV. Have you ever heard of The Bachelor? Yes. Yes. It, it, isn't it discontinued now? Has it gone off the air? or? Well, they just have a new no. host? Well, they have a new host because of a controversy, but it's so much worse than that. My, my dad was actually a producer on The Bachelor, and he'd love to come on and, and tell you about what went on there. It's really shocking. Tony, do you have a problem with that? I don't. No, not at all. Go ahead. Okay, his name is Howard. Dad, go ahead. Hello? Hello, Hi. Howard. Yes. Welcome. I'm going to tell the truth about The Bachelor. Here it is. Give us a story. Everyone on the show is there for the wrong reasons. None of them are really looking for love. I'm telling you. Mm. Oh, wow. Wow. So what you're saying is that we need to kind of get away from wanting to be a superstar and not basically sell our souls to the devil, it sounds like. Yes, but I will tell you this. Many times on the show... There were a couple of ugly chicks we put in there just for personality. Um, I would have sex with them uh, just oh. so they wouldn't feel so bad. Uh, wow. Hey, whoa, whoa. Wow. Whoa. Okay. You have no idea. But that ain't a part of your job. I'm sorry. Here's another revelation. We paid for all the contestants' abortions. Whoa. What? And there were many. I don't understand. As what do you mean? You don't know how many babies are buried in the walls of the fantasy suite. Wow. Uh, uh, what would be the advantage of doing that? I mean, why why would they... In the fantasy suite, we would poke holes in the uh, contestants' condoms. Wow. My God. How did they get away with that? I don't know. To tell me about that, yeah. How did they get away with that one? How, how did they get away with that? That's, that's crazy. No Jews are allowed on the set of The Bachelor. Hey. What the hell are you talking about? Do we have a no Jew policy? Hold on now. I, I right. didn't know that. Well, you're giving, you're giving us a lot of insight. Oh, go ahead, Tony. No, no, I'm saying that's blatant racism. That's just blatant racism. Yes. I mean, come on. Because of my religion, you telling me I can't be on your show? Are you serious? Many of us would rub the girls' toothbrushes on our balls when they what? weren't in their rooms and then what? laugh about it. Oh, my God. I'm uh, telling you, it's wild. I, I definitely think it's beyond that. Um, I want to thank you Our for calling. Our budget was so low in the beginning. We would feed the contestants feces and urine. Okay. <sighs> hey. Now that ain't cool. That, well, that you know, I think deep. at some point I do know about the industry, and deep. there are some really there are some really weird well, things that go on in the industry. And for young adults, you guys need to. <sighs> Be aware of those things. Yeah, I'm saying, you're telling me because of my religion, my beliefs, I can't be on your show? And they hide and all this. I mean, I didn't watch The Bachelor. I've seen excerpts, but I've never watched it. i never watched it, but I didn't know all the... Yeah, I don't know all the stuff that's going on. I think that's uh, very... Uh, Shocking. Yes. 